Hello and welcome back. Uh, something a little bit different today. Not doing anything on my old bus. Not really much to, new to report on at the moment. Uh, we've got today a Volvo 144. Something very special. Owned by currently owned by Volvo UK Heritage Collection, and it is the former car of Leslie Chatteris. So, for all of you that might know, he was the author of the Saint. Uh, this was gifted to him by Volvo and. Volvo UK have recently re reacquired it and it's come to our work which is Hilton Got in uh, Kingsland to uh, be restored. Right. It's just come out of the body shop so let's go and uh, have a quick walk around. There we are, main man Jody Wilson. Jody, you know. Yeah. Yeah. See what's going on behind. Yeah. So it has just been restored by us and it's had the last couple of bits fitted today. Got to put some miles on it for Volvo before it goes back to them. All completely original. Lovely red interior. I'll uh, put a little link to our body shop's Instagram in the description so you can check out some of the photos that have been put on. But yeah. Absolutely lovely car. And in a minute we'll, uh, once Jody's done everything, We'll go for a little drive. Jody can tell us a bit about the car. Yeah. Go through some stuff, see how it drives for an uh, all original car. Absolutely stunning vehicle. Absolutely stunning. All right. I will pause it there and we'll get all set up. Let Jody have a chat, go for a drive. Right then, Jody. what have we done on the front end? Front end. Front end. New old stock bumper T5. Yeah. Refurbished grille, headlamp, surrounds as well. Two new front wings. New mirrors, actual wing mirrors. Nothing on the badge, that's original, that. Huh? Yeah. But we have fitted a new door skin, which was from a 240, that we had to modify to, um, to get it to fit. We have to change the lock. Uh, lock hole. Well, that's it. Awesome. What about the back end, Jody? You'll never see what we've done to the back end. Well, like, you'll never see what we've done to the whole thing, really, anyway. Weld repairs in the arches and in the sills, all completely invisible. Bits of metal cut out to exact shapes and then welded in seamlessly, so you'll never ever see them again, even from the inside. Tubs, new mud flaps, new old stock bumper again. Chrome trim is refurbished, but existing rear lamps just cleaned up. Nice. So we managed to get a new rubber, rubber seal for the rear window, and we fixed all the rust that was going on around the boot lid as well. So that's the original boot lid panel, that. So. Awesome. What about the chrome trims and the handles on the doors? Freshly painted handles before we fitted. New trims sourced through Volvo. And these ones have been refurbished and polished, but I have painted the black. So, original glass, all clean and polished as well, and refurbished these badges. Nice. So, what about, yeah. the, door, what about the door shut? The door shut. You won't get a better door shut than that. Sounds good. Effortless. And the front. Just takes no effort. The windscreen. New windscreen. We had to have the top tint redone because we couldn't get hold of one. So that works really well with a new chrome trim at the top and the rest refurbished. So that's good. Thank you. Tell us a bit about the engine then, Jody. Nothing to say about the engine apart from it's completely standard and relatively untouched apart from fixing a couple of oil leaks. Flush the coolant through to make sure it's got a full flow and fit a new water pump. Clutch, we've refitted a new one. Yep. And a new clutch cable as well. Air conditioning pipes renewed, that's the original pump. 
so that still works really well. So we had the whole system refurbished, new condenser as well, flush through the radiator, new filters, new battery. Um, yeah, so what do you think to these, Tony? What do you think to these? They look good. Yeah, so we cut them out, out of some special sound deadening period of the time and stuck them to the bonnet. So the inside of the bonnet is fully refurbished as well as the inner wings painted as well. So the front panel's completely been removed, blasted, repaired and refinished and then fitted back again. Things like these catches we sent away and had cleaned up and plated. So it just makes all the difference. Yeah, all the little details. What do you think? Looks good to me. What about the sticker tone? Do you like the sticker? Yeah. Original Volvo sticker placed in the correct position to the old one. Looks good. So it's about the inside then Jody. The inside is very original Tony with uh, cleaned upholstery. It's lovely red material. New front door uh, grab handles. Everything else has been cleaned and refurbished and fitted back again before uh, we finish the job. These seals are the original Volvo ones. We just cleaned them up and put them back in because they nicely seated to the front of the car, which helps the doors shut particularly yeah. well. Yeah, definitely. What's the, what's the mileage on the old girl then? 34,000. Genuine. All original. All original, genuine mileage, which is fantastic. Yeah. And you just run in pretty much. Four speed manual gearbox, no overdrive. No. Which is fair, but we've got the air conditioning switches here as well. And uh, very functional. Yeah. Nice little clock in the centre there. And I actually like the seats. They are, they're Real very comfy. comfy. They're very comfy yeah. seats. They're very comfy seats. Yeah. So. yeah. They are quiet seats. Very smooth. You listen to the, to the very quiet just listen to the purr. You hear the purr, Tony? Yeah. You hear the purr of the injection engine? Two litre, 120 horsepower when it was new. What do you think to it? Very smooth and very smooth. Lovely idea. Lovely idea. Lovely idea. typical British summer it's just started to rain slightly don't really want to take it out in the wet or fresh paint and everything so the video may well end here uh, if the weather changes then it will carry on and we'll go for a quick drive if it doesn't we'll do it another time so quite possibly catch you all later change of plan nice and sunny again so out we go off we go Jody all right here we go
quite a lot for the quite a lot for the period. else we've got to say about the old girl then? Well just that it's finished really so we've got an MOT on it today and it, uh, 
pass with flying colours. Well, it doesn't need an MOT, it's just a good thing to have to make yep. sure that it's full road roadworthiness. Definitely. As well, but a bit of peace of mind. You'll never see all the hours that have gone into these projects. Right? You'll never see that the, the fact that we've had all the doors off, we had to bare metal the sills to remove all the surface rust, all anything that was coming through that we thought was going to come through. It's just hours and hours of work, of stripping and cleaning of every component that we took off and it's got to go back on again. The overspray that was on the trims from the previous grease spray and previous repairs. Basically we took it back to the factory paint and started again with it. So yeah. There's just there's a lot a lot of hours. So even the welding around the screen, like it's, that's never going to be seen again. So. So. Uh, and and the trim clips we had made up. The not, trim clips we had made, yeah. Not going yeah, to not going to see printed, those. So hopefully all no, one, no one's ever going to see those. You know they're going to do the job and work well. Um, it's it's just no end. You know all the underneath work as well. So cleaning back the the under seal and and recoating it. Mm. Um, we haven't done that necessarily inside here because we wanted to show a bit of the original uh, factual, the original um, Californian paintwork in there. So we didn't want to cover all that up and, you know, try and make it look like we're hiding things because we're not. Um, we're just making it all, you know, look pretty good and pretty solid. So yeah, yeah. So it. so where can we find some more, some of the progress that you've done on it? I took no end of photos, so uh, we'll get them on the Hilton Got Body Shop page. Yep. Um, and then they can be seen and, and reviewed on there. Yep. Like I say, I've forgotten half the stuff that we've done to this car. It's, it's just so much. Yeah. So much. So, I'll um, yeah. I'll put a link to the Instagram page on in the description of the video, so anybody can check it out and see what else we've been up to as well. Pretty much covers it, really. I think, doesn't it? I think so. It's time to say goodbye to this car. Yeah. So well, we've she's going back to Volvo tomorrow, so yeah. yeah. Awesome. Cheers, Jody, for the little explanations, and uh, no we'll catch up with you soon. Yeah. Well, on that note, we'll probably call it the end there, as soon as we've got the drive in. Thanks, Jody, for, Cheers, for the video, and uh, catch you soon.